Welcome back to Let's Help You Grow Now because I'm here to help you grow now. Now, look, I had watched this interview with Earn Your Leisure featuring Yo Gotti a couple of nights ago, um, and I was just watching it. I didn't really pay attention. I mean, I paid attention, you know what I'm saying? But they was just talking about all types of stuff. But in particular, the 360 deal part, um, some reason I didn't, I didn't really catch catch it you know what i'm saying i was watching but i didn't really catch it now i saw this clip on tiktok this clip right here is on tiktok um <clears throat> actually on my channel let's help you grow now tv it's not where i found the clip because i posted the clip obviously but that's where you can go find this clip basically um but yo Gotti is basically explaining what a 360 deal like why 360 deals aren't bad and I'm going to give you guys my opinion after this plays. Let's see what he got to say. I feel like business is business, right? You know what I mean? Going back to what I was saying by myself in my younger days, right? In my younger business venture. I think business is business, right? I think, uh, who said this? The whole was somebody say this, like, like what's 100% of zero? Yeah, sure. Right? Mm -hmm. So to me, you ain't thinking logical when you think you get everything and nobody get nothing from you. you you're not, it's not common sense. Right, right, right. You know what I mean? So if if we meet, uh, just give us a name. Say there's a brand new artist who walk out this building today, right? What's your value today? How much you getting for a show today? How many records you selling today? How much merch you selling today? <laughs> nothing. You know what I mean? You grossing mm -hmm. 500 a year, dollars. <laughs> right? So then let's say us three put the money on, put the work in. Now you're making 500 million a year or five million, whatever. Yeah. We don't fucking you know that. Yeah. Because it's a term, it's a 360 and it don't sound cool and you seem like you're going to boss up because you ain't never won. It's bullshit. That ain't business. Yeah, business. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so you basically telling me. You want me to put up my money, you want me to put up my time, you want me to take my risk, but you don't want me to get money. Or take, because I, I have a, because it ain't guaranteed that you're going to win. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So that's the clip. That's the clip. Um, That's the clip on um, TikTok. Well, the interview with Yo Gotti is out with Earn Your Leisure here on um, YouTube. So you can go watch the full uh, interview over there. But this is what I'll say, man. It's not that. He's not saying the right thing. It's just the way he's putting it that uh, I agree and disagree. Like, I'm so serious. And I'm not just saying it's just to say it. Like, I'm so serious. Like, I agree and disagree at the same time. Now, I'm only going to speak on what I disagree about. Um, I disagree with an artist going into a 360 deal. Because the way I see it is. If anything, a distribution deal or a single deal, meaning, okay, if this single do right, we come back and, you know, negotiate. We come back to the table for another single. And then you do that about three to five times. Then they could talk about a tape, you know what I'm saying, et cetera, et cetera. Um, I, do, I, do, I do agree with the part where they need to get a cut. Yeah, I agree with that. But... Getting a cut has nothing to do with owning somebody masters. Getting a cut has nothing to do with having a putting an artist into debt, because that's most 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 artists are going into debt. Like let's just be, let's just be one thousand percent about it. They're going into debt, right? Um, but also I will say, he was like, you're not making no money from merch right now today, and you're not selling no tickets today. Okay, cool. So he is right. That artist could be doing that next year without you. They was probably going to do that anyway. Like, sell. And then now they're stuck in a 360 deal. You know what I'm saying? You just never know. Not only that, um, 
I will also say that that's why I say artists need to focus on building themselves up. That way, when you do sign a deal, if you do choose to, um, you don't have to worry about, you know what I'm saying, a 360, them owning your masters. Because I don't, I don't see the point of you owning the masters just because you invested in a record or two. Or just invested in the whole career for real. Yeah, you could just keep taking a piece of the pie. I mean, I agree with them taking a piece of the pie because if you're helping and you're investing, yeah, you're supposed to actually agree with that part. You know, that's not the part. But um, y'all need to focus on building yourselves up, though. If you don't want to end up in a 360. And yeah, I mean, take like a Young Thug. Young Thug signed a quote-unquote bad deal, 360 deal, and look at him now. Besides the, you know, the, the I'm not even talking about I'm just talking about his music career. Music career-wise, he's up. You know what I'm saying? So it just depends. That's why I'm I'm not biased. I'm very transparent to the two of the independent game and the signing game. I will say that um, it's 2023. I'll say by like 2025 and up, um, it's not that nobody's going to sign to a label, but it's not going to be no point. I feel like it's, there's no point right now to sign to a label if you're not doing those things, selling merch, selling tickets, and all that extra stuff on your own. You're just supposed to get the label to advance everything to a superstar level. Like That's what I will sign. I'm just be real. I will sign just to be for you to take me to the superstar level if that was the case. Like, if I was like, you know, whatever, into that. It's like, I will sign for you to like I would need a guarantee. No, it would be a guarantee because I will already be. You know what I'm saying? Moving and all that extra stuff. And no, I just need you to hit put me up on where Justin Bieber is at. You feel me? Type stuff like. Because what's the point of me signing to you if I'm I'm gonna be where where I'm at and et cetera et cetera when I was independent? You know what I'm saying? And it could be making less money when I was then when I was independent. You feel me? So. Like I said, it's 50 50. You know what I'm saying? Um, y'all make sure y'all check the links in my description. Appreciate you guys for helping me get monetized on this channel. In the comments, let me know how y'all feel about what Yo Gotti was talking about with those 360 deals and stuff like that. And I don't want to be on this channel discouraging you guys not to sign a 360. Y'all can do whatever the hell y'all want to do, <laughs> like on some real stuff. Y'all can do whatever the hell y'all want to do. I'm just giving you my opinion, my feedback, my constructive criticism on the whole situation, the whole subject. You know what I'm saying? Some of you guys going to get super happy anyway and sign, sign, sign everything away. You know, like, like, you know, just tap the link, <laughs> tap the links in my description, man. Uh, if y'all want some help uh, growing your career, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Thank uh you. -huh.